hopefully the clients are trying to find a better way to reach the Gonzaga community. And that's really where the project started, was this idea of peer-to-peer -peer marketing. Who best knows how to market to college students? I'll be the first to admit that sometimes you get stuck in your box, you know? So I love the idea of having young minds saying, oh, well, what about this, what about that? Heart-shaped thing will go over a little bit on both sides, but the ceilings are about like two and a half. You know, meeting a group of 11 individuals who had different ideas of what we should do for our semester project, and all females for the first time. We tried to definitely balance everyone's opinion and voices and really everyone had a piece of the project. I consider myself more of a consultant because I may have an idea about what I think would be really creative and great and inevitably what the students come up with is better than anything I would have come up with anyway. We felt that the students would connect best if we kind of connected to the student audience at Gonzaga and that's definitely a group that's, you know, oriented towards service. So we decided to team up with Teen Closet. Teen Closet is a company that is, you know, into giving clothes back to kids who are in the foster care systems. So what we did was we had a week long clothing drive on campus um, and you know we kind of encouraged the whole spring cleaning, cleaning out your closets and donating to a good cause. Service is not a required part of this project. It's not part of the parameters. It's nowhere you know, delineated in the, in the project guidelines that they must include a service component. But once the students start thinking about the best way to promote this business, particularly to the Gonzaga community, they almost inevitably come up with some sort of service connection, which I think is so great and really speaks to the kind of students and faculty and staff that we have on this campus. I'll give you two extra invites just in oh, case they awesome. can come. And there's one in the bag. One person would be the limo rider, more or less. You know, I've done many, many promotions over the years. You never know how it's going to come out until the day. We just had so much energy, you know, leading up to this, we've had so many ideas that finally came together and into place and seeing our work pay off. They were a part of it as people came in. They embraced the idea. They embraced the little um, the questions that were around the store, and then they they help their friends find things. And what I think this project does is just give, give them that extra piece, an extra bit of experience, an extra project that they can take out, take to a job interview and talk to a prospective employer about, this is the work that I've done, this is the impact it had as measured in market research, and, and really show people that they have skills that they've actually applied to a real world project. I think it just gives them an extra edge when they're competing with other students.